Yo, what is going on, guys? Well, MJ2K, Miles Marcus here. Whatever you guys want to call me, today we're back with another video. And uh, so, it's about Cyberpunk. And uh, this has kind of been surfing around the, uh, the web. Uh, as of late, no, nah, I mean, not really. I mean, I, this is my first time I've seen that. I'm trying to see, like, yo, was there any, like, Cyberpunk news uh, that popped up lately? So, I've been kind of curious. I'm trying to look, look, for, look for that, actually. And, uh, and we actually found something. Some, um... Something I gotta take this off. Uh, uh, it's a reefer vehicle. <sighs> I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, I don't know, but um, it's, it's the reefer vehicle, and I I don't know. I'm, from looking at the images right here, it definitely does look pretty uh pretty cool. If I were to say so myself, so I definitely kind of, I definitely want to kind of like look into this and see like what's this all about and all that good stuff, right? And uh, about to see, about to see what's going on, about to see what see what we got going on here. And uh, about without further ado, let's get started. Let's see. What's going on everybody brief little news update for you guys i wasn't initially planning on doing this i was going to save it up uh for a, a little bit of a longer news video but i think this was pretty important this was pretty cool so it does so today cool, the cyberpunk 2077 twitter page tweeted out a new snippet of gameplay i guess ah, you could call it a snippet that's of what gameplay. got the it's four seconds from, from long, but Road. it's of this lovely lovely car here so uh, called the like, yeah, okay, which is a custom okay, built you know. Wraith Gang vehicle based on the Quadra Type Never 66 seen the movie car before, though. with its near 1,000 horsepower, you will ride Eternal, Shiny, and Chrome. Now, it seems that they decided to post this in honor of the 5th anniversary of Mad Max. Ah, Road. Tom Hardy's in it, If you haven't seen that Max movie, uh, uh, go, go watch it. Tom Hardy's it's a great film. Really good uh, and obviously, what we have here is the Badlands. Now, the Badlands is the romping grounds of the Nomads. Um, this, this vehicle is a custom-built Wraith Gang. So, the Wraiths are a... Uh, a faction, a sub-faction of the Raff and Shiv. They're the most hated of the nomads. They are considered subhuman. And they're scavengers Dang, okay. and sociopaths, and they prey on the innocent and weak. Uh, there's a couple different nomad factions and groups. I've made a lore video on that. Obviously, all the lore comes from Cyberpunk 2020, the original source material, what 2077 is based on. And yeah, I don't, I don't think you want to get on the rates bad side. They're, they're, they seem to be not the nicest of folk. Some of them are totally cyber psychotic. They're kind of indistinguishable from any other booster gang. Uh, and apparently, Dog Killer, their leader in the 2020s, uh, was rumored to wear clothing made of human skin. So, uh, obviously, trying to make a very bold fashion statement. And uh, I'm kind of hoping he's he's dead by 2077 because I don't really want to see a dude wearing another dude's skin. That's kind of weird to me. But maybe his <laughs> offspring or, or you know someone else has taken the helm. So uh, hopefully we'll see some cool stuff when it comes to that faction. By the way, this looks fantastic. You can see Night City in the really background does look really nice, uh, of this great. GIF sure. here, Jeff, however you want to say it. Uh, and um, because this is a work in progress, there's a mountain in the back that lacks a little bit of texture. No big deal. Honestly, this this gives me Red Dead 2 vibes, I guess, mainly just due to the environment. I, this, yeah, this looks amazing. Like in a, in a, in I highly suggest you go type environment, the uh, like high quality with a lot of mountains in uh, GIF or GIF of this. Uh, because Twitter, Twitter's I compression kind of ruins it. Moving on, we bit. have a Cyberpunk Red update from Artal Sorian Games. Uh, and a little bit of sad news. As you know, the state of the world is not the greatest right now, and that kind of makes it hard to print copies of books, you know, just release products in general. Cyberpunk Red has been delayed, unfortunately. They were aiming for June, I believe. And now I think they're going to go for a summer launch, which... Um, I don't know if it's going to come out before 2077 or after at this point. So we're going to have to wait and see. I'd love for it to come out before so we can kind of get an idea of the world. Uh, it would just make sense. It's supposed to bridge 2020 and 2077. Cyberpunk Red takes place in the 2045s. Uh, in the 2040s, excuse me. And yeah, so hopefully they get that all sorted Man, out. Dang, and bro. that was your brief news update, you guys. Have a great weekend. I'm sure there's going to be more Cyberpunk 2077 content to come. The marketing is ramping up. It's looking good. 
We yeah, have around yeah, a month sure, till the Night City Wire. After that, they're probably going to be banging out content. So uh, it's an exciting time if you're a Cyberpunk fan. Stay locked on the channel if you want updates. For sure, man. Come on, lighten up. Have a whiff. Better. The heck? Well, game definitely does look pretty interesting for sure. I can't wait for the, uh, the game to officially come out. And uh, yeah, man, um, looks pretty, looks pretty exciting. Uh, hopefully, this game. I mean, hopefully that actual game doesn't really get uh, delayed itself. I'm looking forward to see what, see where this game is gonna go. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Other than that, guys, you guys stay, stay, stay fresh. But MGH one K Marks. I'll see you guys in my next video. And uh, yeah, bye, Z. Alright guys.